Good morning everybody, it's Sunday and uh, Storm Kathleen definitely arrived last night. It was uh, very, very windy overnight. I've been awake for half past four to half past six, there was so much wind outside my roof window. Uh, Baxter was barking at five, but he did go back to sleep. Uh, not much rain, just a lot of wind. Luckily there doesn't seem to be any damage in my garden, which is uh, good news. Baxter wasn't really himself again yesterday. I mean, he had a couple of walks and he seemed fine in that way. Um, a little bit off his food still, but that isn't unusual for him. But uh, yeah, just a bit, couldn't settle, a bit dreary. I don't know, we'll just see how he goes. I mean, he seems fine this morning. He's been sick this morning again, but that's just because he hasn't eaten. That's quite, that is quite normal. That's not really a, a worry. Um, it's just like, you know, not eaten sort of. But um, we'll have to see how he goes. in one of those pods, the doors open on one of them. Hope night in these tents and caravans last night, I'm sure. We've got uh, football in the bit, I think, depending on the pitch, I guess, but uh, so we've not had too much rain over the last 24, 36 hours, so um, hopefully with this wind it'll have dried it out enough to be able to play. Luckily it's a home game, never really mind the home games, even though it's smack bang in the middle of the day, of course. Tails waggy, he seems fine. I think, I don't know, he's just been acting a bit strange, like chewing things and licking walls and stuff, which he doesn't normally do. Or if his teeth are playing up or he's bothering, I think he's just not gotten over the whole eating a monkey chew yet, maybe. It's actually quite nice at this end. The sun's shining, a little bit more sheltered, not a lot. Never have to find out what these were. My sister said to install an app to uh, scan them and work out what they are, but I haven't got around to doing that yet either. The times I do that, they'll have finished doing whatever it is they're doing and they'll be in their normal leaf and then I won't know which tree it was, will I? Come on, Baxter. It's very sniffy this morning, someone to sniff everything. Come on, good boy. Deep. See my favourite trees in a sec through the. Uh, oh no, I think we're a bit we're a bit soon. It's the next gap, I think we look through. Is it this one? Uh, no, I think I'd know whereabouts I could see them, wouldn't you? By now, gosh, it's windy up this end. There they are, just through there. They're nearly lost all their leaves now. One thing though, it's not actually cold today. I don't think it'd be cold in the house, just sort of sat around, but out here walking, it's um, it's not cold at all. I've got my new uh, gilet on, so I've got short sleeves, um, like coat-wise, and just a thin top on underneath, and I'm not cold at all by any means, as the buddly is starting to come. They're uh, also known as a butterfly bush. I was just walking along, chatting away, and then realised I hadn't even pressed record. What I was saying is that we've spoken to quite a few dog owners today, including a couple with a uh, cockapoo who looked very much like Baxter, a bit smaller. And uh, hers is about seven, she said, and how <laughs> it just went wandering on by, whereas Baxter was literally like throwing himself at the owners. Um, and I also said he's getting better at that. He doesn't do that to everybody now, because I do a lot of sit and wait when uh, we go past people. It's like he knows, though, sometimes when people are dog people and want to speak to him. Back in the car now, Bax is waiting for his biscuit, which he has for waiting like a good boy. And uh, yeah, that's the end of that walk for us. And possibly off to football we go in a short while. Enjoy your windy Sunday, everybody.